Hello everyone, welcome to um, Elder Scrolls Online Tamriel, I think it's called. I totally forgot the name. The Elder Scrolls Online Tamriel Unlimited. I did turn down the volume really low in case of a copyright strike. I already had a character. Um, I was just testing how it looked on my game, or my PC rather. And I think I have an idea of what character I want to play. I don't know how popular this game is anymore, but I just got it. And I used to play it on my PlayStation 4, and I had the Imperial Race, but something happened to it, and now I can't I'm get it back. Well, I, I sold my PlayStation 4, so that could be the reason. <laughs> that could be the reason. Um, and... Temriel, or Elder Scrolls, rather. I normally play as a um, warrior, so let's go ahead and do that. Got add lots of muscle. I'm gonna be tall. I'm just gonna increase all of this because I like to feel like I'm a huge character. <laughs> just gonna move it up. How's that look? Oh, my butt's sticking out. Nope. Don't want that. Body marking. Here, let's no gear. We can have a bunch of cuts on ourselves, but you can hardly see them. Ooh, a burn. I like that. And then the face. Have an angular face. That sounded weird. So this game has been out for a while, so I have I feel like I have no need to really talk about it. Um it's like Elder Scrolls game but with MMO an MMO feeling, rather. You don't need a subscription anymore to the game, so that really helps. I wouldn't have bought this game if we needed a subscription. Dormant. Uh, I don't want facial hair. I have a little mustache growing. And my sides are growing, but... I don't want anything. Oh my guy. We have face paint on our marking. That'd be cool. But yeah, this is totally Elder Scrolls, but like a normal game, Oblivion and stuff like that, but with the MMO feeling. I don't know how popular the game is anymore, like I said, um, but we're just going to play it. The music has to go way down because of copyright claims, and I don't want any copyright strikes. Anything else we have to name our character? Lancer. Oh, I have a better one. And I can't use a... Nope, just Dancing Man. Crate. That's what our character looks like. Let's have him have a little more clothes on. That looks fine to me. I don't normally play as a Nord. I normally play as a invalid character. Name. Invalid or invalid character man name. How about dancing? Lance. Awesome, there we go. We're in the whaling prison. I don't know how long each episode will be. Probably until we get something done at least. So move ASW to move. I only just got out of prison. Um, hopefully I didn't spoil anything for you guys. That's where I stopped playing the game. And on my PlayStation 4 walkthrough, um, I don't even think I got out of the prison. I downloaded it, ran out of PlayStation Plus, and then I just stopped playing that. Whoa, and I slowly got rid of it. All right? uh, the name's Lyris. Let me see. 
controls. No, sorry about this, guys. I You've still got some fight left in you. You're going to need it. Dialogue subtitles. Oh. There we go. Loot a weapon. Kinda brings me forward. Keep ready and stay sharp. This place is full of surprises. So we defeated a guard. Keep moving. There are more Daedra on the way. Um. Let's keep moving. Okay, lady. I'm trying to talk to the audience here. So, all right, from what I believe, from what I've read a little bit, we're we're like in a plane of oblivion. Um, I don't know why that is. I totally skipped through the audio so I can figure out how the game is. Keep moving. More guards Let's go. Huh. So apparently, there's a rebel happening. It's not too bad. Prison guard. I'm not actually a huge fan of um of MOs. Not a really besides my good friends, I don't really play with a lot of people online. Let's get out of here, my friend. Anything on this table? Prophet. Reading this. Like you, I am a prisoner in this place. You must rescue me, and I, in turn, must rescue you. Hold a moment. Come here. She's huge. Look how big she is. Like, gosh. Could be my stance as well. The prophet. <laughs> Red lighting. It was very dangerous for him to speak to you, even for a moment. You must think you can help me. Uh, help you do what? Break him out, of course. Believe me, I can use all the help I can get. That blind old man is the only person alive who can help us get back home. Tamriel's a long way from here. Looks like she has two different color eyes, or it could be These from the lighting. will eventually take us to the Towers of Eyes. That's where we'll find the Sentinels. What are these sentinels? Magical constructs created by Molag Bal to guide his vision in Cold Harbor. The sentinels are connected. If we destroy one, the others will be blinded. With any luck, that will buy us the time we need to free the Prophet. Uh, how can we destroy I have no it? Idea. Brute force? We'll find a way. We have to. Be ready for anything. I doubt Molag Bal left the sentinels unguarded. I have so many questions. I'm sure you do. And I'll answer them as best I can. Who's this prophet? He's a strange one, no doubt about it. But he's the wisest man I've ever met. He sees things. Past, future. What is this place where I am? Obviously not in Tamriel anymore. Think of the most miserable, depressing place you've ever been in your life. That's paradise compared to Cold Harbor. And to top it off, well, there's no easy way to say it. You're dead. Oh, okay. I don't know. Once we rescue the Prophet, he can tell you about the gods and the ways of oblivion. I don't understand any of it myself. If I'm dead, who killed me? A man named Menomarco. His worm cult is doing some kind of ritual back in Tamriel. They sacrificed you and everyone in this prison to the Daedric Prince Molag Bal. After you died, whatever was left showed up here. They call you the Soul Shriven. What does that mean? It means you're a slave and you'll spend the rest of eternity here in Cold Harbor, looking under the lash of the Daedra. Unless, of course, you come with me. And you're dead too? No, I wasn't sacrificed. The Prophet and I were brought here... conventionally, if that makes any sense. But we're prisoners here, same as you. How can we rescue this Prophet? It won't be prophet? easy. The place is watched by magical constructs called Sentinels. We won't stand a chance unless we can blind them. I'll tell you more when we get there. And we'll never get there if we don't get moving. Okay, fine. See you later. We should keep moving. Yeah, she's a little taller than me. I don't know if it's because of her race or whatnot. So let's open in this breeding 
bleeding forge. Oh. Gruesome. Difficult monsters will have unique health bars. The more lavish you... The more lavish the health bar, the harder that monster will be to defeat. Uh, press C. Beard, you are good in a fight. Oh. A god of brutality knows of your escape. Hurry. I'm a citizen. I have no bounty. Um, I like health. That's pretty good. Let's commit these points. Character skills. Skill lines allow you to customize your combat uh, style to fight the way you want. You can select abilities, learn more about what they do, press plus to purchase the ability. Abilities can be slotted in your ability bar and fired by pressing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Passive abilities are always active, granting you their benefits all the time. Ultimate uh, abilities are the most powerful abilities and be can be fired by pressing R. Okay. So it looks like... Um... Let's do the Earth and Heart. I had this when I was last playing it. Looks like it was ready in our tab. Um, let's continue this way. Hopefully no one else can hear me. That'd be really embarrassing. Um, audio. Shoot. I don't think you can... Social, text size, leadership, chat colors, um... Uh, it doesn't look like you can speak online. You can only chat. See, it like, when I select a button, it like, brings me forward. It's really annoying. The god of schemes can see every part of Cold Harbor. We need to distract him. So there's a couple players, it looks like, on the game right now. Um, this game's at sale for like $20 right now. 2040 or something like that. 2009. Anything on this table? Nope. Oh, pork is on this table. Couple more. Ugh. Black's gross. Iron girdle, waist, and there's a belt. I'll probably stick to um, heavy armor. It's what I'd like the most. Some mint. Nothing else in these boxes. We have 500 gold or whatever this is called. Crowns. I don't plan to buy more until the series gets a little more popular. There's some bone, we can take another bone. And oh, whoa. What is this? Rawhide breezers. You don't have any enchantments. Oops, I meant to equip them. It looks like I have to repair them. How do I repair? Oh. I don't see anyone else that we can loot from. Guess we can help this player along. What was your name again? Target practice? Oh, it looks like when we help players, um, we get little alliance bonuses. Looks like they're making something there. Um, nothing in the sack. Ingredient for beverages. Ingredient for beverages. Anything? Oh, there's an iron mall in this, um, this game. This chest, rather. And I'm a huge fan of maces more than I am of swords. I studied a lot about plate armor back in the day. Um, because I love medieval stuff. And so, maces kill knights faster than anything else. Some ash in this ur uh, urn. 
Some people trying to get out. Let's see if they're... It's crazy. It's really creepy. Um, anything down here? There looks like a chest to be down here. And some... Brill soul scriven scriven. You have three gold and larva. Interesting. Rawhide jacket. Or jack. Um, yeah, I'm a huge fan of heavy armor in this game. And I hope I remember to pick the warrior guy. Not that one. Not a person to block. So, that's why I rely heavily on heavy armor. I think we already looted over here, but there's a mana pearl or whatever. Never liked um, any armor lesser than medium armor. I do like my free movements though. I like to move fast. Bro, so from what I noticed with the MMO, you just want to kill everything so you can level up. Tell me some more, you scheming hawkers. I don't normally play MMOs, so that's what I've just come to learn by. I got some lockpicks. There's a person over there. I think we looted over here. Before we go that way, let's see if there's anything else over here. We may have been over here already. I'm not exactly sure. Oh! <laughs> There's a great sword that we picked up. A couple of enemy over here. Kinda feels weird with Titanborn with us. There's a nude a nude player around. I don't know why we have the Titan born, but no one else does. Looks like there's this gate over there that we might need later. I don't know how to put my weapon up. It's mint in the barrel. Anything in these crates? Django? Jingo? Barley. Cat person. <laughs> Forgot there's cats in this game, even though. Oh, there's a maul, gauntlets, and a helmet. Anything in the backpack? No. Um. What kind of maul is this? Is this a one handed maul or two handed? Two handed. Same thing that we have. Rawhide helmet. Iron gauntlets, that's pretty cool. Soul shriven gloves, no. You look pretty pretty good right now. Hopefully we can get some better pants. Anything in here guys? Oh, there's a chest over here. Chest is empty, great. See, that's the thing I don't like about MMOs, is that, um... Whoa, what just happened? Is that other players can loot things, and... Then you can't loot them. So I guess we have to re wait until that responds. Nothing back here. Still don't know how to put my weapon away. It's kind of frustrating. Crafted, currency, currency, oh. Some people talking in the chat over there. 
Oh, do I have to talk to her? The sentinels are connected. Oh, if we destroy no. one, where'd she go? Where? Oh. <laughs> Hopefully this responds and uh, we'll just move on. Let's go kill a sentinel. Uh, looks like... Let's go up here. There's a guard. But with as good of the armor as these characters have, I'm pretty sure... I don't know why they can't hurt us more. There's another barrel. Feral. Six gold. Clear water. Anything else? No. Looks like we gotta go up here. Are you not coming up here with me? Oh. That answers that question. Um. Perform a sneak attack to destroy the sentinel. Press crouch when while hidden. Uh oh. I can't sneak really well. Oh yeah. That's pretty cool. Quickly. While he's blinded, we must get to the prophet's cell. Where are you? How'd you say that? Oh. She's right behind me. <laughs> you gotta go to the prophet's cell. Weesh. Jumped right over you. How do you feel about that? So I guess on the time of day normally means how popular this game is. It looks like you still have a fair amount of people who are playing. Cool. You will never escape my realm. Hermamora's whacking tongue. The door's warded. We'll never get in this way. Oh, uh, we can try. No? Talk to her. Damn it. Destroying the sentinel must have triggered these wards. We'll need to find another way in. Maybe Cadwell can help us. Who's Cadwell? Cadwell is the oldest of the Soul Shriven. After years of torment, Soul Shriven usually go insane and turn feral. But not Cadwell. He was already insane before he left Tamriel. Mad as a box of frogs, but completely harmless. You'll see. That's good. How can a man-man possibly help us? Cadwell sees things as he wishes them to be. To him, Cold Harbor is a wondrous place. It's his home. And he knows it like the back of his hand. He's usually down by the river. Let's go find him. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that's all the time I have for today. If you want more of Elder Scrolls Online, leave a like or a comment below. If you wish to play with me, just send me a message through my Steam or private chat on YouTube. See you all next time.